Okay, so I'm starting out with a quarter inch guard, holding her tail out. I'll hold the tail up like this, and I'm going to start underneath. You go with the grain of the hair down. So she has got a lot, but on Marley it'll come off thicker. Down, hold it by the hair on the tip, like so. Make sure the tail stays straight because wherever it's bent, you it will come closer to the skin. And along the sides, very slowly, and as close up to the base as you can get. Good girl, Jack. You just bring it all down nicely on the other side, like so. And just keep going around till you feel you've got it. Blend it in on the sides as much as you can to the top hairs. If the top hairs are really long, you can take a longer guard and start with the biggest and carefully go over it and bring it down so it's smoother with the rest. And then when you get to the tip, you don't, you just want to feel where the bone is at the tip underneath that hair and take the fur off there like that. And so it's not left blunt. You're just going to taper it in all the way around and create a new point of your own at the end so it looks neat and tidy. going over it until you've got it just right. And there's no ridges or obvious lines where you have put the clippers. It's as simple as that. Tidy it up. Take your time with it. Make it nice and tidy at the end so it comes down to a nice gradual taper. There. And that's it. That's all there is to it. Just a nice natural looking tail. Doesn't have to be a super close to the skin rat tail. Just in balance with the rest of the dog. And that's all there is to it. Happy clipping.